We're approaching Curry Lair and we're on these um, very nice glacial slabs in Tartan sandstone. So you can see these horizontal lines. These are glacial striations essentially along the bedding plane. But these white lines that we can see here, which are all lined up and they run through the rock like that. You can see they're all lined up. These are tension gashes and they're produced by shearing the rock in a semi-ductile, semi-brittle way. And so you shear like this with uh, pushing in this direction and stretching in this direction. So you end up opening up these cracks essentially uh, across the shear zone. And you can see here that this set of tension gashes runs all the way across the slab. So that's, and they're all lined up along the shear zone, so they're called on echelon tension gashes. And you can also see here that as well as this set, there's a whole nother set of tension gashes at a different angle, different orientation. So here we have this set, and then we have another set which is actually in the opposite sense of shearing to it. And when you have thrusting, where beds are stepping over each other like we have around here, then you get complex interplays of uh, bending and then unbending and then bending in opposite directions as well as the beds step over one another. And that's probably what's produced the very complex sets of tension gashes that we see here.